Okay, the sun's out. We are going to try taking some solar images with Sea Star using our solar filter. The only concern I have is um, I need to put this filter on before it points at the sun, but you can't manually move it around, so I have to use the phone app for that. So I'm hoping the phone app will give me the appropriate prompt to say, hey, I've moved the gillens a little bit, put your solar filter on before we point it at the sun. Okay, it found it, and it's ready. So I need to manually change over to the C-Star Wi-Fi network. Okay, I'm standing with my shadow on this guy, just in case. We're hitting solar. Um, it says install the solar filter, so I need to push this button to move the lens up so I can install the solar filter. And it's orthogonal to the sun, so I'm not worried about pushing it up too high. All right, the solar filter snapped in nicely. It is installed. And the sea star is tracking and looking for the sun. It's going in the right general direction. Nope, oh, it just swung by the sun. I saw it in the background. I think it should be skewing back to search for it maybe. Now I saw it go by, I saw the sun in the background of this image flip by, but it is still searching for the sun. So maybe it went to the point it thinks it is, and now it's doing a spiral search of some sort around that area. Oh, there it found it. Oh, it's getting closer. Okay, is the sun in the center? Yes, it is visible. Sync succeeded, tracking will be more accurate. Got it. Excellent. Okay, so we're going to hit the autofocus button. It looks like it's mostly in focus. I had it focused on the moon, but we're going to hit autofocus anyways. Um, it has some sunspots in that autofocus region. All right, autofocus completed. Okay, so it looks like we could maneuver a little bit to center this better. The motion there is a little touchy, and it did a good job, so I'm just playing here. It really doesn't need to do this. So you can hit this thing, center it, say yes. Okay, tracking is good. I'm going to take some photos. I'm going to double pinch zoom here so I can you know zoom in. So you can see those sunspots look nicely focused. There is a plus minus on the brightness. You can make it brighter or dimmer or hit auto. I'm going to try to pinch zoom and get this back to the side it's supposed to be. It looks like it's moving in my field of view just slightly. I'm going to take a video now. All right, there's an 18 second video. So this worked much better than the moon during the daytime. So the auto find of the sun worked perfectly the first time. It just worked. Um, the image quality of the sun looks really good. I'm gonna to have to look at these images on a computer, um, but you know, I think this is definitely going to be happy with this image quality.